in this episode of Daisy Underground Stories. You said there are some groups that you don't really like that much, that you have problems. Right, Daki? Yeah, Dakly Dak Dak. Yes, Bobbity Bobby. Let's check out where we are and where we have to go. How was your travel, man? Do you maybe have uh, a free seat? I hope <laughs> he is a good driver too. <laughs> oh, he's a Me fantastic too. driver. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh. Buddy. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Alright, stop here. Bo's dead. Bo Cephas is totally dead. Hey, is it you? Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's get fucking out of here. Hello? Hello? Hello. Um, you are a member of 506, I, I guess? Here. Yes. Is there anyone I could talk to for a minute? Well, who are you? Uh, I'm ever like I, I'm from Pusta, and I'm alone. Yeah. Are you in that Pusta group? Uh, no, there Pusta has not a group. I'm alone. All right then. Well, um, come around to our front gate. You'll find it on the east side of the compound. All right. Hello. Hello. Oh, hey. Hey. What's your name? Uh, I'm ever like. Uh, what's your name? Ever like? Yeah. Oh, uh, hello. My name's Volvo. Lobo. A uh, Volvo. 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 Ah, yeah. Volvo. Hey. Yes. Volvo. Volvo. Hello. Nice. Uh, nice meeting you. Yeah. Nice meeting you too. Oh. Hello. Thanks Come on for in. letting me in. All right, sir. What what can we do for? The question I wanted to ask at all is uh, if you guys do raids sometimes. Mm -hmm. Yes, we do. All right. So uh, I know that the tools for raiding are quite rare right now, and I have some, and I don't do raids on my own, and I don't want to sell them really because. Uh, Who do you want to raid? No, I don't want to raid anyone specifically. I just don't want to use them, but I also don't want to sell them uh, because I don't want that someone raids me with these tools. So I thought it's probably the best idea Good. to donate these raid tools uh, to people who uh, who can use them and can promise me that they don't raid me. And I quite trust the 5 or 6. Yeah, that would be our code. We actually had a man come by earlier and he asked the same thing. But absolutely, we'd never raid anyone who gave us the tool. We'd take someone else's tools for that. <laughs> yeah, okay. Fire 6 has been, uh, always been very good to me. I'm not a member, as you can see, no armband. But uh, I've, uh, they've helped me out a lot. And uh, as a person just usually uh, out on their own, they, I can say they've certainly done a lot of good for me. So they'd be going to a good home. Okay, that's good to know. I think I have three or something. Mm, okay. Well, that's very welcome. Uh, three tools is uh, more than two, and two is more than one, and one is more than zero, so <laughs> yeah. that would be greatly appreciated. Out of curiosity, right. um, you said there are some groups that you don't really like that much, that you have problems. Uh, well, not, it's not really problems. Like, in general, I don't really like the, the group called Dam. I never met them, and they didn't oh. anything bad to me, but I, from the things I've heard, uh, yeah, mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't like their attitude, so... Yeah. Uh, yeah, and the second group, but that's not really a thing, is uh, the group of Torchwood, I think. And I think they raided me a few times, I'm not actually sure, but I think it was these guys, yeah. Uh, uh, if I may ask, where is your bait? Uh, I live in, in Pusta. Hmm? Oh, actually, I think we've come across that bay. If you want to, we have a little 
uh, let's say, play date with Torchwood. And uh, if you want to, uh, we can go to Pusta first and then uh, go knock on their doors. And uh, since you will provide the raid tools, you will also get some stuff that we get. Oh, that sounds great. That sounds great. While the five or six seemed to be some noble guys, I was happy about the decision. They elected a guy to escort me home and bring back the tools to their base. Yeah. Uh, is he the guy that uh, comes with me? Yes. No, no, this is Bob. No. Oh, hey. hey Bob. I am the guy. Hello. Hey. Bob was coming. Bob. We call him a Decky Deck. Decky Deck. Right, Decky? Yeah. Deckly Deck Deck. Yes, Bobbly Bobby. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Okay, I see you. Guys, stay safe. Thank you. Take it out. Yeah, you too. Good luck out there. Stay All safe. Right. And if anything happens to you, come by here and let us know. Okay? I'll do, I'll do. Right, Have a good day. Yep. Yeah. Alright. So let's head to Pusta. Yes. My apologies about that. Oh, no problem. Let's check out where we are and where we have to go. Where do you usually hang out? Uh, like, are you usually in the north or south or? Do you have? Do you even have any uh, favorite? Not really. I like talking to people. You know, I like traveling. I uh, recently I've been hanging up a fair bit at the Chernogorsk. There's a uh, there's a group there who recently established who I like quite a bit. Uh, in Chernogorsk? In Cherno? Yeah. Yeah, Cherno. Uh. Is it uh, is it the Chano neighborhood or? I don't know if they have a name or not. I just know people okay. hang out. <laughs> okay. There. Wait. Where the heck are? Uh, do you know where the where the tower is? We just came by. Unfortunately, we completely lost our orientation. And a few minutes later, we even lost each other. Luckily, I could reach Volvo via radio, and he agreed to meet up again in Pusta, at my base. I reached Pusta way before Volvo, so I sorted out the raiding tools and some other payments for the 5 or 6 and waited for him. Then I heard a car. Could you just, uh... Wait here. I want the car. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to involve you in the business thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Water. Hey, uh, uh, let's uh come over here and we'll talk. Oh, nice to see uh, you here. How was your travel, man? Yeah, likewise. Oh, I found myself back in um back in Rogopo. Those are your locks, by the way, that you gave me for carry. Make sure you pick those up. Oh, thanks. Yeah. I'll we'll be heading straight to Zillian, of course, after this. Drop them off to the 506, like we agreed. They're actually uh, giving me a ride, a couple of friends of mine. Uh, about those sledgehammers? You got them? Or, yeah. Yeah, it's one one x two sledgehammers. That's wonderful. Alrighty. Is there anything else I can help you with? Uh, no, not really. Do you need, do you need anything? Uh, nah, I'm good. I got everything I need. Okay, let's go to you. I'll be fine. So, um, greet the uh, 5 or 6 from me again, and uh, I wish you good luck and a safe travels, man. Yeah, likewise, likewise. Take care. I hope your base doesn't get raided again. That'd be awful. <laughs> yeah, I hope so too. Hello. 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 Let me allow me to introduce you. This is uh, Gouda. This is Bortavius. Or, uh, Prince. 
Hey, nice to meet you guys. Hello. Nice to meet you. Oh, you got a. Didn't mean to. Great to car. pull up so quickly. I didn't even know you had a place around here. Oh yeah, this butte right here. This this beauty. She'll take you across across these lands in no time. It'll take you to outer space sometimes too, unannounced. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh... Um, oh, do yeah. you do you maybe have a, a free seat? Because I, I actually never drove uh, in the car since the <laughs> since the apocalypse. So it would be maybe be a great experience for me if you don't mind. Just if you know what you're getting yourself into. Yeah. yeah, as long as you understand, though I may be seated behind the wheel, I don't have complete control over what this thing does. Well, okay. <laughs> so if if you wanna if you wanna maybe put some stuff in a safe area that you that you know you might not wanna lose, you're more than welcome to come along. But it can be a dangerous endeavor. I, I'll do my best. I don't want to die myself, but uh, you know, I can't. There's no guarantees well, on the death train. Okay, yeah, I would. Um, I don't need to drop anything off. So, I would like uh, to to uh, go with you for a few kilo kilometers or, or meters, if you don't mind. Yeah, I think I think we're headed somewhere. Where are we headed next? Zelenogor. Zeleno, yeah. So we're headed towards Zeleno if you uh, if you want to head that direction. Sure. We'll probably uh, uh, go through Cherno first, I think. Oh, there is no door on my side. Oh, good. <laughs> that's good. You have a quick exit. I think if you look at the yeah. floor, that's the sweet spot. Looking at the floorboard inside the car. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, I see. For yeah, some yeah. reason, I just got out. Don't. Uh. <clears throat> All right. But Don't worry about it. You're fine. Yeah, so these are my friends I was talking about. Okay. They're very kind of pick me up in my uh, in my time of need. They're uh, absolute angels. Yeah. <laughs> and I I hope they are a good driver, or he, he is a good driver too. <laughs> oh, this is a uh, fantastic driver. Don't worry about it. One of the best. One of the best in Charners, at least. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh. Buddy, uh huh. Uh, she's seen me do some crazy things. I have complete confidence in you. <laughs> At least in front of our guest here. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm more reserved. <laughs> when it's just me and Gouda, I let loose and do crazy things. Yeah, I th he's thinking he's impressing me, but I'm shitting myself, so... <laughs> oh, I don't know. <laughs> actually, uh... <laughs> That's the intended result. Oh. <laughs> Maybe, maybe. It works. It works. <laughs> so, with Posifis as a driver, we all headed back to Zelenogorsk. Posifis told us that the car is not under his control all the time, so I really hoped we make it there alive, so Volvo could give the tools to their new owners, the 506. You are an absolute strength, Posifis. Yeah, it's great. So far, I can say I, I felt quite safe in here. Otherwise, I would have, have had to walk the entire friggin' way and I would have lost my mind. Try it! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, stop here. Hey, what the fuck are you shooting at? What the fuck? Bo's dead. Cephas is totally dead. Go to a safe spot. Go to a safe spot. Go inside a building. 
do you think it was the five or six? I don't know why they would do that. I, worf, worf. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna whisper to you. Yeah. Uh, the, the five. I mean, we're friends with the five or six, and we go through here all the time. So I'm not certain why they would have done that. But, but there are bandit bandits out there, man. I don't know. All those running off from the car. God damn. Hello? I'm talking to the 506. Can anyone hear me? Is there anyone on the radio right now? I don't know, should we go and check? Hey, uh, it's Volvo. It's Volvo. Hey, 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 yeah. We are Coming in here. In. Yeah, please. Please come in. <laughs> With me. If you see anybody else, shoot him. There's some asshole okay. here fucking shooting at him, and it's not 506. Okay, okay. If you see anybody else that's not on the roof of the base, shoot him. Don't even think about asking questions. Just fucking blow the brains up. Do you know if it's one or more? It's one. We were running around, but could not find the shooter. Soon after, the server restarted. After I logged back in, I headed to the car to see if Volvo or Gouda may be there. Hey, is it you? Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. You wanna get in? I'm fucking get in the fuck out of here. Oh, thank you. Let's get fucking out of here. 